really controlled center. Was pressuring forward most of the time, but didn't shoot a whole lot. Was able to capitalize with a takedown and win the match. Should also be noted, Peterson got called uh, for kind of blocking with the head. There, Peterson shooting already and more here in match one. Nice single leg, he's got it elevated. Lunaredo pulls Peterson down with the wizard. Nice work by Munoretto here to wrestle back in. He's got a leg of his own now, working for a stalemate. Man, Peterson is so close to finishing there. It's almost like just inches away, but good, good counter scrambling defense from Munoretto. Yeah, I was really impressed with Munoretto, match one. Impressed with Peterson here, match two. You can tell he goes, okay, I need to shoot more. And Peterson. And passive was offered now. Official having a word with the clock. Okay, now we're good. So yeah, they go right right on the activity clock with the two minute. Yep, no periods. more warning anymore. Peterson on the clock. Not sure if I agree with that. He was controlling center, took mm -hmm. the only shot of the match so far, but somebody's got to go on the clock with no points are on the board. Yeah, the big thing, that can make a big difference in, in these shortened periods. Who goes on the clock first, when points go up. Not the worst position, though, for Peterson. If no points are continued to score, mm -hmm. you would assume Minaretta would go on the clock next. Peterson unable to score, Minaretta on the board first. So we're seeing a lot of what you said in the first match there. Peterson doing a really good job controlling the center, pressuring forward, but M not able. holding ground, taking ground now. Yeah, yeah. But no, no real offense generated yet. Munoretto kind of shrugging, mm -hmm. saying, what do you want us to do here? The clock will wind down. The shot clock point, the only points in period number one. Peterson close on the leg attack, but beautiful defense from Munaretta to work for the stalemate. Yeah, I feel like this this match could be decided in you know one exchange as, as low scoring as it's been. Not really many risks taken from either wrestler so far. So it'll be interesting to see what the game plan is coming out of the break here into the second period. And potential clock issue here. So boarding is a score. Official working with the table worker. And we're good. Period two underway. Heavy snap, Munoretto jumps front head. Really working for an angle, but nice job squaring up and clearing the position from Peterson. Peterson jumps from outside to a single leg. Munoretto front headlock hooks the leg. Three quarter Nelson for a second, but jumps to the takedown instead. So he scored in the first one as well. Nice defense there mm -hmm. from Munoretto. So just a minute to go now in the match. Peterson gonna need to get to his offense pretty quick here. Caution and one offered for fingers. I believe interlocking white paddle, white paddle. So no, no point. But Peterson has to be careful here this last 50 seconds.
Peterson level changing, needs to fire one off here, now down to less than 30 seconds to go. Caution and one offered as Peterson gets to a low single. And we're locked in the crotch. Peterson trying to come out the back. Nice work by Munaretto with near ankle scramble. He's gonna hold on to this, work for a steal mate. He's at least burning clock here with 10 seconds to go. Now dives under, slips his yeah. head, and that'll right. do it. Nice work by Dominic Mutoretto. <laughs> Let's out of screen. He's our first cadet world teamer of the night. It's really the defense for Dominic Munaretto that mm -hmm. got it done. Peterson shooting, Munaretto capitalizing, and or not allowing Peterson to score. Working for the still, it was in the first and late in the second. And he is our first.